Hi, good people. Welcome back to the vlog. So if it looks like I'm wearing the same clothes that I just closed out the other vlog, it's because I am. Same day. Um, I am now at Lifetime. I needed to come to the gym after work today because I forgot a shirt at home and I couldn't do my cardio on my lunch break. So I'm here about to knock this out. And since I'm here, I am going to do extra cardio because I'm not in a rush to get back to work. So look at God, won't he do it? Um, hopefully I sleep good tonight um, because I did take, I'm drinking pre-workout and then I did take a fat burner and oh my God, where are my manners? Welcome back to the vlog. Thank you guys for coming back and supporting your girl. Let's see how long it takes to get this video up again. Once we get to 100 views, I drop another video. So, I'm matching y'all passion. Anyway, so let's get this new vlog going. Let's get this cardio going. And, um, yeah. See y'all after cardio or tomorrow, whenever. Alrighty, YouTube. That is done. Um, it actually felt really good, but listen, I think we're gonna have a little chemical war warfare on our, our on our hands, arms. Okay, cut, retake, action. That actually felt really good, but I think we may have a little chemical warfare on our hands for tonight because I actually took pre-workout, um, fat burner, um, a little too late in the day. For that cardio so now i'm about to go home and take some melatonin um gummies and also um one of those ashwagandha calm and relaxing drops to try to counteract all this so i can go to bed and not be up from the stems y'all i'm doing a whole lot and for no good damn reason to be honest with you but you know hey just keeping it real i always tell y'all don't try this at home kids anyway it's done. I did an hour of cardio. I am proud of her. Oh, Lord. Sorry. We're going to get hit by the car. These homeless people getting out of control, y'all. Good morning, fam. So, the devil is playing tricks on the girl. So, I'm about to weigh myself. I'm just getting home from the gym. Um, before the gym... I was 149.4. I just want to see 148 something. I've literally been teetering between 149.0 and 149.6. For this is the third week. It's obnoxious. So I just trained. I just sat in the sauna. I went from EOS to lifetime sauna. So that I can get the hot sauna. Because EOS sauna, that particular one is trash. So I just, I just want to wait 148 something. So I'm about to wait myself. I was supposed to check in with Justin. He said that he was, before he made any changes this week, he just wanted to make sure he dotted all the I's and crossed all the T's. So let's see if we were 147 by Wednesday. I was not. I was 149. Ay, ay, ay. So I didn't even bother checking in. I'm going to check in tomorrow morning. So let's see what the scale does today. Oh my God. She is. Next slide. It's the simple joys in life you don't understand. Oh my God. I just needed that encouragement. So if I'm beyond perfect today, I mean, do maybe an extra 15 minutes of cardio somewhere. I might be able to move some mountains, y'all. Move some mountains. I don't want him to change nothing. I ain't got no more to give right now. So we're going we gonna to see what these videos look like tomorrow. We're going to see what the scale is. Because the scale needs the scale. Like we always say there's a multitude of ways to measure progress. Blah, blah, blah. But the scale needs the scale. All right, good people. I am on my way to the gym um, for round two, that is. And I am so stoked about this 148 point, what was it, four or two this morning? I feel like if 
I do this extra 15 minutes of cardio on round two and get all my water in, I feel like there is no way I can't get those four ounces today. So the plan is to do an extra 15 minutes of cardio here on round two. My God, can you turn any slower? Jesus, fix it. Um, they are kicking around. So I feel like if I do that, I can be in the 147s, y'all. So we're going to move and speak this into existence. I'm going to do all the things um, today to make that happen. So yeah, I'm going to do an extra 15 minutes. So a whole hour of cardio for round two right now. And um, yeah, I want it, y'all. I want it bad. I just want to see the number just once. I just want to see it. That's the plan. I'll let y'all know if I actually do an hour or not. So I did an hour. I did 40 minutes on the um, elliptical, 10 on the Stairmaster, 10 on the incline walk. Um, I will have to admit, guys, I feel really good today. Today is a good prep day. No doubt it is because of the scale. Definitely encouragement. Um, but yeah, I feel good today. It's a good prep day. Another thing I've been trying to make it a conscious effort. Why am I doing looking up like that? Anyway. Another thing I'm trying to make a conscious effort of doing is getting, oh, because I'm trying to look over the phone, <laughs> um, is getting my all my water in before um, I leave work. So essentially, I am at work for 10 hours a day. We do that um, every other Friday off, so we do 10-hour days. There's no reason why you can't drink 128 ounces in 10 hours. If you can't make that happen, just throw the whole body away. Um, so I've been doing actually really good. So I think I'm not as far on my water as I would like to be by this point, but let's see what we are when we get back. But I've been doing really good. So that's also been allowing me to have a diet Sprite, Sprite Zero with dinner at night because I'm done with all my water, which is another incentive. Cause if I'm not done with my water, then I don't get to have a Sprite Zero. So little things people, but yeah, so Lord, let's be in these 147s tomorrow. check-ins this morning I was 148.8 pre-workout so let's see what I am post-workout I was hoping yesterday I was 148.2 so I was hoping whew, to be in the 147s today I have not used the bathroom yet so if I don't I'm probably not gonna be but we shall see I took the, the supplements yesterday around four so i think for me taking it earlier in the day my stomach's kind of crampy like something wants to happen but i just don't think it's going to happen by check-ins so i think for me i probably should take it like maybe eight or nine o'clock in the morning so that i can go to the bathroom on a schedule that works for me long story short all right so listen here good people she checked in so of course y'all know i would add my check-ins the weight post workout so i think i told y'all before going to the gym pre-workout weight was 148.4 or 8 or something post workout weight which is the weight we count 147.0 so excited check-ins look very much improved i went to the bathroom after checkouts so that probably would have helped my midsection look a little tighter but we will take it however it comes i think the supplement stack i'm going to take um, I don't know if I said this on here or Instagram, but I'm going to start taking it um, earlier in the day for me. Taking it at night is early in the day. 
I'm just gonna start doing that. So anyway, me and daddy are running errands today. We are going to the airport to do the whole TSA pre-check stuff, pedicures, run by a few gyms and do some gym membership stuff with the whole active fit direct. I've done most of mine, but he hasn't done his. So we're gonna do that. We're gonna get some lunch. You know, we out here in the streets, y'all. I said I did 60 minutes, meaning adding that 15 minutes to two sessions this week. I think I'm going to do that. Actually, this morning I did an hour because I don't have weights on Friday. So I just did an hour instead of 45 minutes. And I think I'm going to do an hour now because we went and had hibachi, which um, wasn't bad or anything, but um, I don't know. I just feel like doing it. I, I feel like doing it, so I'm gonna do it. I got I got the energy and the strength, so why not? We still got plenty of fat to lose over here. But I will admit that I can really see an improvement. Um, literally, just kind of all over, like literally all over in my check-ins. So that's that's good. I don't necessarily lose more in one place than the other. I kind of lose, cons you know, consistently just everywhere a little bit. So. The stomach is definitely looking better though. So let's just hope this supplement keeps doing what it's doing and I keep going to the bathroom. I took it this morning at five, no, at like maybe nine something. Um, I think my stomach's used to it in the sense of it doesn't like hurt my stomach anymore. So that's good. But we'll see if I go to the bathroom tomorrow. I did go today, so it's, it's doing its thing. I can appreciate it. So ready for getting ready to go do round. Good morning, YouTube. It's Saturday. Pre-gym workout weight is 1418, no, Jesus, 148.4. So we'll see what it is after the gym. I want to say it might have been 148-ish. Pre-workout yesterday too, actually. So. I thought it said 147, I was like, <laughs> I did not finish all my water. Um, I did pretty good though, for it to be out as long as I was yesterday. I did really good on water. Um, I had a diet Pepsi, so I had liquids, just wasn't water. Um, yeah, so I will keep y'all posted. I slept really good after my round two. I came and I took some um, melatonin and these calming drops relaxing drops has i watch your and all that stuff it got it at a show it really helps with the melatonin gummies all right y'all today is grocery day as well so we got a hit we did safely yesterday for our meats and veggies and popcorn rice cakes so today we got to go to walmart after the gym but after that i'll be ready to check my weight so i'll keep y'all posted let me find out. I'm gonna get another drop. I mean, another drop would have to be in the 146s because I was 147 even. But 
which I ain't gonna make good myself. But I do think by Sunday, if I do everything right today, I think by Sunday I might can be. And I want to sixes. I have absolutely no plans today other than being great, relaxing, and doing all the things for prep. So and I'm going to try to go see my Lonnie too. Other than that, that's it. All right, y'all. I keep y'all posted. <laughs>
So that was like perfect. Um, it actually was really good. It made me want to do more. And I almost did a couple of glute exercises to take those off the table for tomorrow's leg workout. But I try to be very careful about doing that because rest and recovery is equally important. So um, as much as could be considered rest and recovery at this stage of the game. So if I only have 45 minutes of cardio today, it was probably best to just stick to that so that I can have a good workout tomorrow and just not, you know, overdo it. So especially when it comes to the knees and back. So I just opted to get my butt up out of there. I sat in the sauna for 10 minutes and now I'm about to go home and meal prep before I shower and do anything and knock that out. And um, which I'm pretty lazy right now. So all my vegetables is stuff I will make on demand. Um, I bought a fresh bag of spinach shredded cabbage because that cooks really easy really fast and honestly those two you could just chop them up and put them in the in the uh, container raw and just microwave it and for me that's the perfect texture that I prefer um, wait 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 what am I doing here I, okay um are we turning oh the lights were okay. um and I bought asparagus. So this week is just asparagus, spinach, and cabbage. Um, so all I have to do is literally make two meats, some ground chicken, 96% ground chicken, and chicken thighs, boneless skinless chicken thighs. I throw those in the air fryer. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that now before I even get in the shower and have my, um, have some five ounces of chicken with some shredded spinach and cabbage for this meal. And then I'm gonna have some of the cinnamon egg wraps, light, egg life wraps for um, dessert and it's 352 honestly i'm about to take some um some of those uh relaxed calm calm drops and some melatonin and i might be sleeping in the next couple of hours which is the goal the more sleep i can get the better i still wake up super early my biological clock just wakes up early during the weekend so i still will if i don't set my alarm i will still wake up at three or four o'clock so um i try to just get in bed early during the week i mean on the weekends so anyway that's what she's doing Good morning, YouTube. So we are going to close this video out here. It is Sunday, I just got in the sauna. Today was leg day, um, <clears throat> it was good. I quit while I was ahead. So I did four exercises, um, four to six sets, 10 to 12 reps, as heavy as I could. Um, I'm not crawling out, I'm not walking out in any pain. It was good, it was effective. So I'm gonna, I was gonna do two more, but I'm like, I have glutes tomorrow, so let me just not push it. So, um, that's that. You guys saw check-ins. What else? So, um, we are at 106 views. So, it's time to close out what I've been recording and start preparing for the next episode. I don't know if I wrote a check that my ass won't be able to continue to cash. However, for now, let's just keep it going. Let's get to 100 views. Share it. Like it. Subscribe if you have it. And every 100 views, I will drop a new video. I kind of have found my flow of vlogging for this season. So, or yeah, this season, this prep. So it's not that bad. So um, as long as y'all continue to support me, I will keep my word and I will drop a video every 100 views. Um, so yeah, what's on the agenda for today? I've already meal prepped and all that stuff yesterday. Laundry is done, folded, score. I need to wash my car this morning. I have a pedicure at 11. Then I'm going to go do cardio. Then I'm going to go hang with Milani. And then come back home and chill and get ready for the week. So, as usual, thank you guys for coming back. I appreciate you more than you know. And I will see you guys in the next episode.